welcome back to my channel today. The Grays Box. So, um, I actually tried this out um, for free um, through the Pinch Me um, promotion. So, I went and I got a free box to taste. Um, and so, it was a four a four snack box came in the mail um, there was a bit of a, a weird thing that went on um, with the company and I'll get into that later um, it's kind of gonna be one of the reasons why I give a thumb down but um, I have my Mountain Dew here in my Halloween cup already and we are going to crack into this brand new Grays box. Now I did unwrap it and look at it, but I have not tasted any of these yet. And I did want to just get on here and kind of go through these snacks with you guys and taste them a little bit and um, just give you a little bit of information about Grays as a company and my experience with them. So if you wanted to learn more about that, um, stick around and uh, we'll get right into it. So Grays does come in this pretty standard um, like brown cardboard box, but it is biodegradable, 100% recyclable, and made with wood from a sustainable forest. And you can also learn more about their packaging and what they're doing to help with the environment on their website, um, grace.com slash packaging. That's gonna be a thumbs up for me because as you know, I do like to um, help the environment as much as I possibly can. So all of these snacks are custom uh, picked for you. So you can get a box with four and I believe one with eight. Uh, we're gonna show I like that you can customize it, but it is the same price. I wish it would have been a little bit less expensive for the four pack. Um, it is $13.99 for a box, um, which is a little bit more expensive. I think it's a little bit more expensive than BoxyCharm and like Birchbox and stuff like that. This this actually Grays came twice in the month. Sorry, my phone is shaking. Grays came twice in the month when BoxyCharm will only come once a month. So. Um, you kind of want to figure that out and see how many of the snacks you actually would eat in comparison to um, what you would throw away because obviously you wouldn't want to pay $14 every time for a box if you weren't going to eat them all. So um, let's crack into the box itself and check out what we got in this one. So first of all, I am going to show you the back here. I did cross out my address because, I mean, obviously. But, um, so it says, turn me over for exciting snacks. I like how it tells you which side is um, up and which is down because sometimes I have issues with that and I dump everything out all over my table. Go ahead and hold it up like this and I'm going to open it. So inside, I believe this is a passion fruit, maybe, or or a, or a pomegranate. I think it is a pomegranate. Don't yell at me. But <laughs> there's a pomegranate on the top, and I've already dropped my things. Um, they keep this whole uh, like this theme on all the packaging. They keep all of it on the website as well, so that looks pretty cool. All of these are. Um, like shrink wrapped packaging on the top it tells you exactly what it is you can see the barcode and if you have any questions about any of these there is a little booklet that just fell out actually um, that you can check these out on and it always says grace box on the top so you can find them on all your social medias and tag them in it so in my first box, there was a, a bunch of literature on top, um, similar to this stuff, and there were actually a few little gift cards on top, so you can give them out to your friends for a free box. I really like that marketing ploy, and I say it as a ploy because, let me explain. 
So when you order your box the first time you put in the free code, um, they will send you the box, the box of four snacks. Um, but they will not update you uh, afterwards and say, hey, do you want to continue this service? So what they basically did is, with me at least, I don't know if I was just neglectful or what it was, but they charged me the $13.99 a couple days after I got my first box. For the second box, which is the one I have right now, um, and then again a couple days later for a third box, all in the same month, uh, a couple days apart. This is the way they do things, but I have to give it a 1 out of 5 for that. I really, really hate that that happened. It caused a predicament with my bank, with everything like that, um, especially because I was not expecting it. So when that money came out all together, I was just like, oh. Okay. I did go ahead and get it all settled with the bank. They sent me this box before they had a chance to cancel it. So I got this second box and I figured since I won't get another one, I'm just going to review it. It's something easy and simple and I said I was going to do it. So I ate the first box and so I have a, I have a little bit of a grasp on the boxes now and I can tell you a little bit better. But actually, so let's get back to this. So it says... Pick a free gift uh, with your first shop order. So what you can do is when these come to you, these little packages, which are super neat to throw in your purse or whatever, you can take, you know, the barcode and you can actually find them on the website and you can order them specifically. So I'm guessing if they were going to give me a gift worth $8.99, um, if I were to order something specific from their shop, which I'm not going to do. So basically what it says is just go on to grace.com, um, you know, add any of the snacks to the cart and then check out with the free gift um, um, label thing, like special code. Okay, so they also have this uh, promotion um, that you can give out to other people. It says get your first and your fifth free Graze box so you can get them for free. There's three of these at the bottom. I also got three of them in my last box. So it really gives you something to, um, you know, hand out to your friends and family. And then on the back of this sheet, they show you all of the nutrition information and um, everything like that so you can keep track of your nutrition and it also tells you the dates that they're good till. All right, so now that this is kind of open here and you can see, we'll get that cord out of the way, so you can see what's actually in the box. Now this is the first level. So when I got this box, I did not expect it to be two levels this time. I thought it was just going to be a regular four level. So we'll start with this one up in the upper left hand corner. You pull it out. So this snack here is actually going to be the raspberry and coconut muffin. It has raspberries, cranberries, coconut, amaretti drops, and almonds. In here, you can kind of see it a little bit better. I'm excited about this because it has coconut in it, and I absolutely love coconut. Um, I have them all corners open so that I can just sprinkle some on in my hand and eat it. Um, I'm nervous. I got a whiff of some of them and I, I don't know if I'm going to like it, so.
it tastes a lot like the coconut, which is good. But the power of the raspberry and the cranberries takes over, makes the whole thing sweet. And I usually don't like unsweetened coconut, but that makes it a little bit better, so. This is a really good one. I would try this. This one is definitely a four out of five for me. Now traveling down to the lower left, it is booster seeds. So this has sunflower, pumpkin, and flax seed in it. Um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. I am indeed not a bird, um, and I am a bigger girl. I don't eat like a bird. So this snack, if I would even eat it at all, would probably not fill me up. So we will definitely see. Seeds first. Um, this is what it looks like. Open up the top. It's a loud car outside. But... This next one is the Active Nutrient Blend. Um, it has walnuts, dates, pumpkin seeds, fuel metabolism with a boost from essential minerals. Here it is again. I have never tried dates before in my life, so hopefully I will not gag. We will be trying all of these on camera too, so this is going to be interesting. one on the top is sesame garlic crunch. Now this sounds delicious. So garlic sesame seed sticks, oat brand sesame sticks, and multi-grain soy crackers. Now if I were to um, get these, this would probably fill me up if I had like a whole big box of them. But... Pennsylvania. 
of my mock salad, too. Decent. Decent. This is probably a 4 out of 5 again. I'd eat this one again. And this is the second half of the box, which I didn't know about until I got into the box. So again, there are another four products in here, which again, they're very nicely packaged. Um, and that's pretty cool. So we're going to start at the upper corner here again, just like before. So honeycomb flapjack, rusted rustic rolled oak flapjack with honeycomb and chocolate drizzle. This sounds absolutely delicious. I hope it's as good as it sounds because um, I would actually contemplate buying these again. These I'm so so excited about. I hope these are good. Crack this baby. Mm, smell the granola bars. I wish you could smell this. It's nice. In here. This is turning into a look bang real quick. Let's go ahead and crack it open. You can't really see the honeycomb or anything in it, but apparently it's in there, so. It's pretty good. Oh yeah. Next, there is Louisiana wild rice and beans. So, all right, and the last one I'm gonna try because I don't think it's necessary to try the popcorn. We all know what popcorn tastes like, but the Gray's wild rice and beans. I'm gonna try that. It's already open. These ones, I'm kind of dreading a little bit, so I'm just going to pour them into my hand. So they taste almost like... Like Chex? A little bit? But obviously the health, healthier version? And they're only 140 calories. I'm spilling things everywhere. Um, these are pretty good. Then we have cinnamon pretzel. So this is uh, 120 calories. It has vitamins and minerals, and it's pretzels and cinnamon honey almonds. So this one's pretty s simple. I think the honey almonds are going to be pretty good. But pretzels are just pretzels. So... They had their signature popping corn, and it says, please do not burn me. I'm way too tasty. I hope so. It can be ready as as little as 40 seconds. Wow. That's pretty cool. Now, I'm guessing that HelloFresh and um, Grays are sister companies, or they're working together because, again, I got one of these in the box, um, and maybe I'll take it up on that, but I really don't want it to happen like it did the last time, where it just kind of, like, took money and took money and took money, so, um, we'll give it a try maybe in a later video, uh, like it if you want to see that. Right now, I will show you. Uh, if my camera will focus, 
my eat agains and my won't eat agains. Um, these are just because they had either no flavor, they were repeats and things. Um, but all of these are so good. Like, either they remind me of things that I've eaten before, or they just have a really unique taste that I haven't eaten before and that I would love to try again. Okay, so all in all, my final thoughts on the Gray's boxes are 5 out of 5 for packaging. Love that it's biodegradable. Love that it's helping the environment. Love all that. Um... Also, I like how each of the little snacks is in one of these containers. You can throw it in a plastic baggie and you can just be good to go. For, for the actual snacking wise, most of them taste really good. They put together flavors that are reminiscent of things either that you've tasted before, that you've had in your childhood, um, all that kind of stuff. So things like that. They're pretty good. They're just taking snack foods and they're making them healthy for you. Um, and I'm all about that mission. It's just brings us to the next point. If you'd like to pay $13.99 um, three times a month for three different boxes a month and you can feasibly afford that in your lifestyle, then do it. I think it's awesome. I think what they stand for is great. It's run by two women that are health nuts. It have, they have a nutritionist. They're so on board with what they're doing and they love it so much. And they run a blog telling all about, you know, how they get these ideas for these snacks. And I think it's a really great message and it's really, they're good products, but I don't know. I can't feasibly think that it's okay to pay $14 four times a month, or three times a month. So, you kind of have to gauge whether you have that money or not. Um, I myself, just being as a new YouTuber and a hairstylist, I do not. So, getting these boxes give me, gave me a really great outlook, um, a great footing to stand on for the next time if I ever did want to order again. Um, and I think that I would definitely rec you know, recognize this and recommend this to a friend um, if they had the means. If you guys have tried the Gray's Box, please leave it down in the comments below your um, experience with them. If you liked them, if you hated them, if you didn't like the snacks. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again in the next video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on all of my social medias linked in the, bo in the box below. Thank you so, so much for watching. Bye.